Hello everybody, Big Beardy back again. Yes, I know I've been gone far too long, far too long from this YouTube experience, but I'm back. I'm going to do some videos. I'm going to talk about some stuff and just generally mess up your lives a little bit. That's why I'm here. So before we get started, uh, I was going to do a video like three weeks ago, do some week in the life ofs, you know, fling them out and everything's gone to crap. <laughs> in the last three weeks and I haven't been able to do it so I just thought I'll get a video out because I haven't done one in ages and I'll just talk about what I've been doing why I haven't been on the YouTube and uh, just generally what's been going on so because a lot of people have been asking me those questions where are you, where are you beardy what are you doing are you dead in a ditch not quite yet one day maybe so uh, yeah that's that's the plan before I start though I thought I'll do a little sort of uh, question of the day for my new start to the videos Put in the comments down below, but my question for the day is, where's your favourite city or place to go to park up? It could be because the work's good, it could be because you enjoy it there. Whatever it is, it doesn't really matter. Mine's actually Bristol. Uh, I like the nightlife, so when I park up, I park up near the city and I go into the city and, you know, see what's going on. It's a busy place and there's always good work coming out of there. So that's why I enjoy going to Bristol. Not too busy, but busy enough. Or, or Oxford or Cambridge or something, because they're nice places. But anyway, right. But put in the comments down below what your favourite place is. So, what's been going on and why haven't you seen me? I'll do that first and then I'll be tell, telling you what I've actually been doing work-wise. So, long-term viewers of my channel, I know it's been a while, <laughs> um, will know that um, I, I was looking, when I stopped doing my videos a while back, I was looking to get out of the van and, not get out of the van, uh, spend more time at home with my family. My kids are growing up, you know, they're all... They're both, my youngest two are in high school now. My daughter's actually moved out. Yeah, I know, right? I'm getting old. You can tell in the grey. Look at the grey. Look at it. Look at it. Um, so I wanted to be closer to the home and my wife's had some health issues, which hopefully she's looking to get an operation in, well, hopefully before Christmas, which oh, fingers crossed will help a lot but she's got a lot of health issues so I just wanted to spend some more time at home and you know I needed a break from the YouTube I needed to stop doing that for a little while and spend some more time with my family so that was sort of my decision making in that and that's why I stopped doing it it was it was it was taking up so much time just recording the videos editing blah, blah all that other crap um, and I wasn't doing as much long distance and therefore I couldn't really talk about as much and I talked about everything and then, you know, a week in the life off I couldn't really do because I was constantly out. So that's why I stopped doing it. And I, I sort of thought, we'll take a break. And I was going to come back ages ago, but I just, I, I just didn't get around to it. But now I'm here. Okay? Don't be too upset. I know you are. Right. So that's why I sort of stopped. Um, and what I've been doing is I, I started doing a lot of work for myself. Um, I had my own, a few of my own contracts and stuff. And I was doing a, I was doing a, I did some furniture flipping at one point. That was interesting. That was a bit of fun, you know, finding stuff on Facebook Marketplace, picking it up, sticking in storage unit, selling it for more, whatever. But it was taking too much time for not enough money. So I, I did that for a few months, like as a side project. But what eventually happened was it got to, not last the Christmas, last Christmas, bloody hell, we're nearly in June, can you imagine, believe that, it's nearly halfway through the year, I feel like I've done nothing, but not last Christmas, the Christmas before, contract came up um, to work for Amazon, which I'd never worked before, 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 as a contractor, working for a company that works out of Amazon, and because it was Christmas, it was like six days a week, um, I think it was paying at the time around £186 for the Christmas period a day, which isn't great money. It's less than, you know, I try and make a minimum of, well, it was £200 a day, but it's probably gone up to like 250 with the price of everything as minimum, you know, make for the day. But anyway, um, and I thought, all right, I'll jump on that because usually at Christmas, I would jump on the multi drops because it kept me at home for Christmas. That was the plan. So I jumped on it and um, Christmas came and as most of you know, these multi drop contracts for like every and that that come up, you know, that... Christmas finishes, it ends. The Amazon one didn't though, kept going. So I was like, okay, well, I'll keep going for a couple of months because it keeps me at home and everything I've already just explained. And um, so I, I kept doing it. And then it was one of those, yeah, this is why I've never wanted to be employed and always wanted to be self-employed because I fell into the employee trap despite being a contractor. 
it just became comfortable. It just became, yeah, get up on earth. You know, I work, you know, whatever days I was down to work, yeah, I turn up, I do it, I go home, you know, blah, blah, blah. And it became a job, which sounds weird because what we do is the job, it's work. But doing the long distance stuff, it's not really a job. It's like a mini adventure every day that you get paid for. But it turned into a job. And then I was, I eventually got to the point, I was like, right, well, I'm, I'm bored of this. Don't want to do the driving anymore. And an opportunity came to work in the office for this company uh, at Amazon. And I was like, all right, I'll jump on that. So I jumped on that. Uh, that that was sort of, and, and bear in mind, I've been there like a year by now. I know, right? And it, I wasn't just, I had some of my own work as well at the same time. You know, it wasn't like I was just doing that, but it became a routine. I don't like routine. Uh, <laughs> so I jumped in the office. Uh, I think I was it, over Christmas. It was manic. It was pressure. It was stressful. Um, you know, the money wasn't any better. But I was working on the road and on the office. And then it, it got to this Christmas, got through it. And then this year started and everything sort of changed. Um, and look at my hair. I know I keep going on about my appearance, but I look terrible. So it all changed this year. Um, loads of new drivers came into the Amazon thing. The work, the workload increased. So there was more drops. And Amazon do this. Anyone who's worked for them, they will push you to your limit. They'll give you as much as they can. There's good aspects of it. I'll do a video on Amazon. I might do it because I'm still doing a little bit of work for them at the minute just to make up days when I'm sort of don't want to be doing long distance because of whatever. Um, but the, the amount of drops increased, the amount of time we were on the road increased, the pay didn't increase and the amount of days dropped. So you're making less money and you, when you are on the road, you're doing more work. And I was like, I've had enough of this. And I, I'd already had enough of it, to be honest, a long time ago. I wanted to get back on the long distance. And I had a long conversation with my wife. It's like, oh, I need to get back on the long distance. And I need to start making decent money. And I need to do, you know, I've got other little projects in the work. And Amazon is sucking the time out of me. But like I said, I'll do a video on sort of a day in the life of an Amazon driver. If you want to see it, let me know in the comments. That's it. Um, yeah, and that was it. And that, that's basically what I've been doing. Um, and then, like I said, about a month ago, I was like, I need to get back on the long distance. I want to do, I want to get back on the YouTube. I want to do the week in the life. So I want to you know, actually feel like I'm doing something rather than just turning up to a job I don't enjoy. And I do not know how I fell into that trap. I do not know how I did it. You know, I never wanted to be like an employee, turn up every day, you know, punch in, punch out. I, that isn't how I work. And I, I, I just got stuck in that cycle. So yes, I was a bit silly. I wasn't making good money. I wasn't enjoying myself. Why the fuck am I doing this? But that's what happened. Um, and that's basically what I've been doing for like the last year and a half, which is sad, I know. And I wasn't doing the long distance. And I, I know I could have gone out on the road, done long distance, done the CX, done whatever app you, you fancy using, and made a hell of a lot more money and actually gone and enjoyed myself a little bit out there in the wild. But no, I got stuck in the trap. And now I'm like, fuck this shit. But so back to the, um, three weeks ago. I was like, oh, I'll get back on the long distance. Soon as I say I'm going to do that, this is this is how the world works, and it likes to kick you. Soon as I say I'm going to do that, I'm going to get back on the long distance, I'm going to go and make good money, I'm going to make some videos, I'm going to enjoy myself, enjoy my work again. Two people, two different um, friends, colleagues, whatever you want to call them, phoned me up and said, we've got contracts coming up. Big ones, big ones. Uh, one, to, one starting right away. The other one probably won't be ready to rock for a month or so. And I was like, right. And they're local. So I can't even do the long distance of them on them. But they are worth it. They're good money. Monday to Friday. So I get my weekends. And that's one of the things. I've been working weekends at fucking Amazon. Why? Don't even get a good barbecue and whatever. You know, have a good drink. Because I only drink it all, uh, on a Saturday now. I'll talk about it in another video. Because I've lost a load of weight. I lost... um. Uh, how much did I lose? Three? I'm trying to think of it. About 40 pounds. I put a little bit on since Christmas. I will admit I put about another half a stone on. But I lost what? I think I might... I'll talk about that. If you want to know how I've lost my weight and what's going on, in the comments, this is how you do it. Or just, you know, message me or something. But anyway, I'm, 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 I'm rambling. I ramble. 
for those who have never watched my videos before, I am a rambler. So, um, what was I talking about? Yeah, these contracts are coming up. Now, one of them, which was very lucrative, hasn't happened. It was meant to happen two weeks ago. It was meant to start happening this week. It was meant to start happening next week. And it just isn't. We know the industry. You think something's going to happen, and it doesn't. And you don't think something's going to happen, and it does. So I've sort of gone, right, that one's a no, no start. And to be honest, because I've been messed around saying, oh, we need you in that day, and then it got pushed back. I'm like, I'm pretty much done with that. The other one who's who's through a friend of mine, um, shout out, Steve. Um, hopefully we'll hear about it about mid-June. Um, knowing the industry, knowing how these things work, it probably won't be till the beginning of July. I'm not holding my, my breath on that one, but when it comes along, I'll probably do it because it's, you know, it's well over 200 pound a day or 200 plus a day. Um, it's easy work and it keeps me home. So the, the, the week in the life videos may not happen depending on what happens with that. If that doesn't happen, I'll just be long distance full time and back doing what I actually love doing. So yeah, that's sort of what's been going on. I know I've talked a lot of bollocks for the last 10 minutes, but that's what's been happening. Wanted to stay at home or close to the family because my kids, you know, they're, they're kind of high school. They're turning into young men or not quite yet. But, you know, they get into that age where they've got a personality, <laughs> you know, my, 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 my daughter moved out. Um, my wife was struggling with her health issues and I wanted to spend more time with her. So I thought we'll, we'll, we'll stay more local. And then I got sucked into the Amazon trap. Yes. So uh, bear in mind, I was doing other things on the side which i always do but to be honest it's been a good reset for me I, I had so many forks or whatever it is and so many fires or whatever you whatever the analogy is that i was exhausted i was getting down some things were working other things weren't you know and i was trying i was like right we've got to get this going and, it, and i was just like actually let's just shrink my world down a little bit for a while spend some time with the family and just reset and that's been me that's what's been going on so i just thought i'd fling this video out there so you all could get up to date with what i'm doing because a lot believe it or not people have been asking me i don't know why i don't know why you're interested but some people are so i thought i fling the video out we've reset we're restarting and we're going again we're going to do some youtube stuff days in life week in the life you know we might do some little adventures just Anything you want me to talk about or want me to try and do, put in the comments. I know I've actually put shit in the comments a lot this video, but I feel like I need to get it all going. I need to start going with this shit. But that's the plan. And um, I'm, I might do a video on how I've lost the weight. Because I'm, yeah, I'm actually not, well, I'm still fat. Let's be honest. I'm, I'm chubby. <laughs> I got curves. But I got big. I got big. Uh, and I'll talk about that with that video. But there we go. That's that's what's been going on. So, uh, yeah. Just, um, I, I like, I'm one of those people, I like starts. Fresh starts. I like getting going again. Because the, the, the possibilities are endless. I could be a YouTube millionaire this time next week. But anyway, so um, I've been Big Beanie One. You've been awesome. You remember this. Be safe out there. Have a great day.